All right, I need to preface this by saying I really like Starazona. I like Starazona. It's great company. They do a very difficult job. So I, mean, I, I would not want to have to design something that takes an F10 telescope to an F1.9 telescope successfully. So I really love Starazona. Now that that's out of the way. cow their filter slider leaks light badly I was I was trying to get my hyperstar rig set up and I was having all kinds of problems with the data there you know there was just cloudiness everywhere in the data and you know it was obviously a light leak so I started looking for where it was and it turns out it was it was the filter slider drawer from Starzona the official one with all the you know I bought official filter slider drawers you know there's nothing it, it should have worked right out of the box uh it leaked light all the way around the seam where the two halves of it were bolted together it leaked light around every side of the uh of the filter drawer um around all of this you know this area and down the back of it against the body and, and yeah we'll, we'll take a look at the darks and you'll, you'll be able to see the difference and uh even with their with their official blank here, screwed in, and then this in the drawer and trying to take darks, you you can't. I couldn't do it. It was, you know, the 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 mean of my dark was like three thousand. Um, so yeah, it leaked light like crazy. Now, a normal person at this point would call the company and say, hey, you, you know, this this thing it doesn't work. Uh, I need you to remedy this situation, and that's probably what I should do, but uh, I, had, I don't want to wait. So what I did was design a solution. Um, I modeled up and 3D printed these little shrouds that cover up glue on the top of the drawers like that, and they cover all the, all the seams, and then... In addition to this, I need to wrap tape all the way around the body because the seam in the body leaks. So with this glued on the top of the slider and the tape around the body, it doesn't leak light anymore. Um, so yeah, I'll, I'll, I'll put a, a link to uh, download the, the, the model for this in the description if you want to you wanna print these out yourself. Um, I'm not going to glue these on because my friend is going to be making some nice text on the top of them for me. Saying, you know, like HAS2. But yeah, so the the filter drawer does not work. It's not going to work for me without these modifications. But yeah, I'm a, I'm a little disappointed in how much how much the filter drawer leaks. It's it's not a hard fix, you know, you, light leaks are a thing that we deal with. We, we find them in all kinds of equipment. The, the uh, tilt plate on the ZWO cameras leaks light like crazy. Um, but yeah, it's just it's something we always have to hunt down and make sure it's not interfering with our data. But, uh, you know, it's, it's, a pretty, it's a pretty simple concept to make sure that body's sealed and make sure that the you know, the design of the drawer has enough overhang that light isn't pouring into all the cracks. So I, w I was a little shocked to find it leaking that badly. Um, maybe I got a defective one. It was on back order for a while and, you know, they were rushing them out. Maybe it was a defective one. Maybe they don't all leak like that. But mine leaks like crazy. But anyways, with these things glued on, it doesn't leak anymore. Also, I modeled up and... I'll, I'll put the links to these models in here. Uh, storage boxes for the sliders. Um, and they, they link together like this. So yeah, these uh, storage boxes, they work pretty well. Um, so I'll put a model for these up for you guys to download. Um, these models are tuned to my SLA printer, which kind of bloats the, uh, the prints. So you might need to 
fatten them up a little bit to get them to grip properly uh, because yeah my printer kind of bloats models so I need to um, make them a little bit skinny so they'll work but uh, it, it was surprising that I had to that I had to stop the light leaks like that I was slightly disappointed but that's life <laughs> Okay, back in the house. Oh, uh, I need to figure out. Okay, filter slider test. Dark. Let's just. I don't remember which one is which here, but it started out with it just naked. Whoops. With you know just the slider. And then you know adding tape to it. Yeah, these are one, these are one minute darks. Yeah, they're all in order here. But yeah, this this is just just the Starzona filter slider, and just with the the dark blank installed. And you know, that's a that that is not a dark. That should be this is a one minute dark. Let's look at the. Uh, Yeah, you know, median value of 2,400 ADU. That's that's nuts. And this was just with uh, some tape over the drawer, I believe. Maybe. I don't know. Let me see. Yeah, just with the, the, the tape covering up the drawer, um, you know, you can see our median was down to 385. And it looks more like a dark. Yeah, this is just this was just covering up various parts of it to locate exactly how the light was leaking through. Here you can see it's still over on the right side. Um, and then as we progress here, 47, 35, 18. Yeah, the and this one the last one I took was with, you know, that shroud installed, tape all around the body, and you can see our, our, you know, our mean and our median are almost the same at 305, and that's just with my pedestal. My pedestal adds 300, so we're only getting like 580 U on the dark as a median. That's, that's a, you know, that's a dark dark with the with the filter slider all covered up. So you can, you can see it's it was obviously leaking a ton of light. Um, so yeah, I mean, uh, the proof is in the pudding. All, the only thing I was doing differently was changing, you know, covering up the, uh, the filter slider in different ways. And unless it was completely wrapped up like that, it really leaked a lot. 388. The, the <clears throat> with, uh, just covering up different parts of it, it always averaged like in the mid 300s. But yeah, with that uh, with that outer seam all uncovered, it it was bright, and uh, that's I couldn't get my data to work. You know, the my flats weren't working. Everything looked like garbage, and with now it's starting to look good. But anyways, clear skies, everybody. I hope you find and seal up your light leaks because they're horrible. They will ruin your life.